Here's why Burkamp was such a revolutionary footballer. In 1992 and 93, Burkamp finishes third in the Ballon d'Or. So all the top clubs in Europe are after him. He decides to sign for Inter Milan, who were struggling to catch up to their rivals. Inter Milan wanted to change their style of football and they wanted Burkamp to be their number 10 and lead the way. However, it doesn't work out and Inter revert back to the olden style and they force Burkamp to play in a direct style of football, which doesn't suit him and he only scores 11 goals in two seasons. Well, Inter's loss became Arsenal's gain because Arsenal were also hoping to have a playing revolution themselves and they wanted Burkamp to lead the charge. Arsenal smashed their own transfer record to sign Burkamp and they signed him with the exact intention as Inter Milan did two years earlier. The newspapers were skeptical of the signing and they read out Arsenal signed Burkamp with the hope to bring in new era. And fortunately, that's exactly what Burkamp does. He's the catalyst for what Arsenal were to become and a year after Burkamp signs, Arzo Wenger joins Arsenal and he unleashes Burkamp to his full potential and the rest they say is history. The legendary Dutchman is one of the greatest players to grace the Premier League.